Holy shit, that was intense. No escape. So No Escape stars Owen Wilson in a very different kind of role. He's with his family, they're in Asia, I don't know what country it is. It's not to say the movie didn't tell me what country it was, just from my recollection, a lot of times they're like, oh, welcome to Asia. So I guess they're in the country Asia. But it's more of a serious, intense role for Owen Wilson. He's there on business, he's there with his family, and then all of the sudden militia just start taking over and blowing people away. It's chaos, it's murder, and his family's right in the middle of it, so Owen Wilson needs to get his family out of there. First of all, I was impressed with Owen Wilson in this role. His comedic nature brought comedy relief when you need to come, not comedy relief, but it kind of eased the tension in some scenes. You really buy him as this average Joe dad who wants to get his family out of this shitstorm. And it should be noted, it's not like this side's killing that side, and they're just kind of in the middle and they can weasel themselves out of it and no one will really notice. No, people are coming after them because they are Americans. Not every country is a fan of Americans, but yeah, they're not. Not in the country Asia. And now to keep the YouTube dipshit commenters at bay, it should be noted that I know Asia is not a country, it's a continent. And my remark about the country Asia in no way implicates the countries that make up the continent of Asia. Kind of a no shit moment, but trust me, I read the comments, it has to be said. And this movie really was intense. It reminded me of Black Hawk Down, but there are no Marines. They don't have weapons, they're just running. Kind of reminded me of a zombie apocalypse breaking out if the zombies were sentient and used weapons and hunted you down. And it made for some intensity in this movie, and you know this movie would be so much easier and less intense if he did not have kids with him. So a lot of times, how do you explain to your kid, like, uh, sweetie, they have machetes, and machetes kill people. I know you're five years old, but trust me on this, you really need to shut the fuck up. It's tough. You want to make her feel safe, but you need to let her know that not talking is really important right now. So it was perfect for this movie to give him a family he needs to get out of there, because you really gravitate to that, and you're like, oh yeah, I need to get the family out of here. Shit like this scares the hell out of me. It really does. It's not ghosts, it's not ghouls, it's not goblins, it's this kind of stuff. Because there are countries that go through this shit now, it's a very real thing, and it's terrible. So being plopped in the middle of this as a civilian is very effective. A couple of scenes in this movie, you walk away from going, did the the movie need that it was because it was like really uncomfortable in a couple of parts and without those scenes the movie still would have been intense and enjoyable but with those scenes it adds an element of discomfort but it really hits you in the face it's like yeah it's not pretty this is actually the ugly so whatever the movie was trying to do i gotta say it was really effective in doing it guys in the end no escape was very straightforward it doesn't take long for the shit storm to start shit storming you're pulling for owen wilson and his family you want to see them get out of here it's a very brutal movie it's uncomfortable but it is an intense movie and you walk out getting your money's worth i will say no escape is a good time, no alcohol required. My only question now is how long will it take for someone to post a Facebook article or a YouTube video going, eh, the militia and no escape were actually the good guys. Watch this, your mind will be blown. Oh my god, my mind's so blown. It'll happen. It's only a matter of time. All right guys, so no escape. Have you seen it? What did you think about it? What's your favorite escape movie of all time? Whatever it is, whatever you think, comment below, let me know. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right here to see more.